Is there a fire in hell? First, it must be understood that the words of Jesus, when they speak and describe these spiritual things are spirit, they are life. So, to understand the fire of hell you must not materialize them. We will see, there is certainly something material in the fire in hell, but basically the fire of hell is a spiritual fire, that burns both demons and damned, but the demons have no body and they are constantly in this inner fire. So, how to understand it? What is this fire burning in hell? The soul of man and the spirit of the angel are not created as clean slates, made for good for evil and everything will be neutral. That's what Sartre thought. No. The heart of man is created with a hollow mark, an infinite dwelling in size made to receive God. The man and the angel are made to see God face to face. Hence the emptiness in the mind of the man as long as we do not see him face to face. The anxieties, we experience them on earth sometimes, for people who simply do not know if God exists, in the pain of poor women. It is a pain that purifies their souls. Sometimes for people who know God but who reject it in all lucidity, this fire exists, but this time, his pain is preferred to undergo it than to convert to the true God. Well, it's that fire that reigns in hell. The fire of hell is simply the rupture that exists between the soul, naturally made, of the damned to see God as well as the angel, and his free will who prefers to undergo everything rather than to accept the conditions to see God to know, humility and love. This tension between two spiritual forces in them, the deep nature of their soul programmed like that, and on the other hand their free will sets their souls on fire. This fire, very concretely, is a permanent anxiety, deep, devastating, a profound absence of meaning to life. But they are fighting against her. They prefer to live it but they do not give in. They are lucid people, people masters of them. So this plague, this perpetual fire, they accept it rather than repent. 